Hey everyone, in my last vlog you saw me make five of these bad boys. Well, they're all done and tomorrow's the day that I gotta take them to the show. And I was like, I really want to put them in like a suitcase because I'm chucking in a few like like garments and shit, like these low life tees and, and some stuff. And I'm like, oh, how do I do it and not look like just taking it in a box? I'm like, okay, I'm gonna get a briefcase, make it all for Zaz. And so I started looking at like cheap briefcases, you know, just for the, for the, um, for the novelty of it. And, uh, I found one on Marketplace, which is real cheap, but I couldn't be effed driving to get it. So I thought, hmm, totally got this from the op shop. It's kind of cool. It's blue. Let's have a look. Yeah, totally. Bowls drive race. Nah. Um, so anyway, what? I'm, so it's a cool, like, blue vinyl bowling ball case. So like, not 10-pin bowling, but lawn bowling. So I'm just going to castrate this box, a.k.a. take the balls out of it. And we're going to use it to, to, like, nicely put these in and lay the clothes over it. So it's a nice unboxing boxing experience for the people that get it. So, um, and I'm going to screen... <laughs> going to screen print the top with my logo and yeah so I think it cost me like two dollars so can't really go wrong it's a bit smaller than a briefcase but I think it's kind of cool so I've donated well going to donate to these to a guy at work who can use them Whew. and cut these center braces out and yeah see how we go Well, we are late as fuck. So, we're at St Kilda now. We've missed the takeoff and the skate park. And we're just gonna finish off at St Kilda, Prince of Wales. That's it. Are you on? Is this yours? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I don't do any. I'm not, I'm not as cool as these guys, but it's just a bike I bought a long time ago. So. Yeah. Uh, at least you're riding and you're here. Exactly, man. Exactly. It's all about just being being Yeah. It's cool. All you have to do is first three runs for It doesn't ruin it for everyone. Yeah. It's still, it's still, everyone's here for it. Tell us what you got. Yeah, so I had these forms when I was making my show bike. So yeah. These are my trial ones, so I decided to put them together. 
and uh, yeah, see how they work. They work really well on this bike. They're about 26 four, 26 inch forks for on a 20 inch wheel. Yeah. So they're a bit rough. So I decided to call the bike rough cuts. Fuck yeah. Fucked up the front, the front fender. Put it upside down. That looks down. gnarly, actually. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> Put it upside down. Got this little hockey strap in there to, to help the steering work out. Oh, to like center it. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna pull yeah, it back. Right. It'll pull, pull it back forward. But oh, the concrete. I like it. Got a little grinding wheel down there. Oh what? <laughs> yeah, just to, Oh, that's sick. See, that's the actual, that's the actual wheel to cut all this shit. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Thing, so, and then there's this little guard out the back as well. So, yep. Yeah. And your Bunnings just, scale flat bar. Yeah, exactly right. That's, I love you it. Know, you know it well. So it's what 50-50 RHS? Yep. 1.6. Yep. It'd have to be for this, like weight, wouldn't it? Yeah. How's it ride? Yeah, it rides really nice. Yeah. Really smooth. Yep. Uphill, not so much. It's hard. Oh, fuck it, guys. Let's just go. Yeah, have to walk it a bit. Yep. Yeah. That's sweet. How long did it take you? Oh, a couple of weeks. <laughs> Four weeks, yeah? Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and you've got, what, two handlebars separated with a bit of Rio bar? Yeah, so, what it is. Fuck yeah. Um, my auntie's bike, she had a, she has a girl's bike. Yeah. And originally, they're blue, the southern, st uh, southern star frames. Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah. Um, I picked one. I picked up four of them in a row or whatever, just from the tip. Oh fuck yeah! Yeah, easy. So I had a bunch of parts. So I had like wheels and handlebars and stuff. So my dad made the suggestion, put them uh, like welding together. Yeah, it works. Yeah, it really works. Yeah. And you just got, got the MIG welder, or is that stick welded? Uh, most of it is MIG welded. Handlebars MIG welded. Yeah. Most of the frame and the crank. But once I got to about. Once I welded the whole thing together, did all this here, the reinforcement. Yep. Um, and got here to rip, because I only uh, like tacked this one in place. Yep. I came back to fill in the welds, and I ran out of MIG wire. Oh, I was like, on a Sunday. damn, I don't have enough money, so I had to patch up this little part here, which wasn't really strong. Yep. And a little massive hole in it, it just kept on going. Yep. Um, and then I had to do this chain tensioner. Uh, last night. That was oh, last sick. Job. Last night. That's of, what you want. Um, double sided tape and two part epoxy. Or epoxy, as my dad likes to call it, because two part epoxy is way too long to say. Yep, and you've got your skateboard trucks as your seat. Yep. Is that like a, what do you call that? Like a uh, pinstriping Mexican. Yeah, Mexican some... seat pack or something. Yeah. But uh, I've got a bit of, you know, those big foam mats you get from Kmart. Oh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, there's a layer of that. And oh, that's the actual cushion part. Yeah. Is the, oh, yeah, the EV, EVA matting. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And then two, there's like another thing that came by. Um, you get like these uh, foam cushions. Yeah. And then I did a layer of like um, old skinny jeans. Oh, really? Right. Yeah. Oh, the tension. Yeah. And then um, went over with the Mexican pattern. Oh, I love it. Made up a little frame to go over the top of the scrape chunk and hold the hold to the frame. Yeah. Yep. No, you've done well, man. And is this clear, or are you going to help hope it goes rusty? Uh, I might let it rust a bit, and then take everything off and then clear it. Yeah. yeah. The aim was to clear it, but deceiving. didn't get a chance to do it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's sick. I love it. And it rides alright. Yeah, it rides alright. Having the length would be like real sturdy, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yours? Hey? Oh fuck yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. 
How are you? Yeah, good, man. Good. Sorry, I missed the skate park and everything. Oh, I went to the wrong one. You're all G, man. I went to a river, river slide or something. Oh, geez. The rut runs the same every year, man. Hey. Slow, slow. Hey. Ride every time. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a good Oh, that's good. Well, it's good time. Good time. Good time. Oh fuck yeah. Dude, I think it's a truck. <laughs> Just uh that's the end like ending scene of the rat run. Uh before the buff. Case is lost. No touching. Case is lost. <laughs> no touching. Oh yeah. <laughs> you can do it! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> you are, I couldn't steer the bike, that's the problem. <laughs> you got any up, Sean? Oh, up to the left. Oh. Oh, there you go. I was worried for a sec, you were down pretty, pretty, pretty yeah. long time. You know? yeah, good, thanks. It's only a bit of a Thanks, bro, I lost a bit of weight, I look like a new man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so I bought this. I actually bought the frame, bro, from uh, one of the boys here. Yeah. And um, yeah, he got it. He got it painted, but I painted the fenders, handlebars, yep. and, and the guard here. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Is, yeah, it, yeah. is it comfy to ride? It's okay. I just need to get a bigger seat. Oh dear. Yeah. yeah my ass get that huge. fat ass happening. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, 
Yeah. Uh, well, no, I'll come with him. Yeah. I won't. I won't do it just like. Yeah. I don't have Rupert. So, uh, <laughs> I would love to have Rupert though. Yeah, turn around. <laughs> Tell me turn man. around. Um,